Cake Lovers, XD360 here, bringing you another video. Woo, yeah. So today, 4J Studios just released some skin packs to Minecraft, Xbox 360, and the Xbox One. So yeah, I just want to go over the skin packs, and yeah, so here, we'll, let's, let's get started. Alright, so the first skin pack they did release was the uh, first, you know, birthday skin pack that they did release about two years ago now. Um, I already had this one, and this is actually the skin pack I use my birthday skin which is awesome, um, but yeah, there's pretty cool skins in here. If you guys don't have the first one yet, you should definitely download it. Uh, you got the Blaze Man, the Ender Dragon Man, Party Steve, Party Creeper, Cake Zombie, which is another cool one. <laughs> um, Party Pig Zombie, you got the Party Hero Brian, you got the Party Skeleton, you got a Party Pig Man, you got a Party Cow Man, you got the Party Squid Man, which I think uh, Iblis Squid uses that one, so that's pretty cool. Um, you got the Party Snow Golem, you got Party Enderman, Party Iron Golem, uh, Top Hat Sheep Man, which is a pretty cool looking one. Uh, you got the Mushroom Man, you got Wolf with Collar, uh, Steve with the Creeper uh, box on his head, and then you got the Creeper with the Steve box on his head, and then you got the first ever villager, the farmer villager, and then you got the uh, Birthday Present Man, and then you got the Slime Man, and you're back to the Skin Man, uh, the cakes, <laughs> Birthday Cake Man. But yeah, uh, there are actually really cool skins in here. You should definitely download this one. Uh, it is free for, uh, I think, up until the 17th. Uh, so yeah, you guys should definitely download this first skin birthday skin pack. So, uh, they also released the second birthday skin pack, which was released a year ago. Uh, there it is. It's a pretty cool looking one. So you got the Party Plastic Steve um, with, with the suit. And then you got the Party Plastic Creeper uh, with, with the suit and then the hat. And you got the Party Zombie Villager. Uh, you got the Witch. Um, you got the party wither skeleton, which is a pretty cool looking one uh, And this this one they added a wither skin You should definitely download this one just because of the skin. Uh, it's pretty sweet. You can become the wither uh, It's not an exact copy of the wither, but it's pretty close. It's actually really good. So yeah, and then you got the party red hat um, Oh red cat not red hat. <laughs> red hat. Uh, it's, yeah, this is the red cat. It's got the uh, cool little antenna things I don't know what they're called, but yeah, it's a good, it's a really cool, cool skin. Um, and then you got the Party Black Cat, which is uh, pretty much the same. They're, they're like the different versions of the Ocelot Cats. Uh, this is the, the, the Ginger Cat, this is the Black Cat, and this is the Siamese Cat. And you also actually got the Ocel the Party Ocelot Cat, which is a pretty cool looking one. And uh, yeah, so the next one here, uh, of course you guys all know who this is. This is Stampy, um, and you got the Party Hat Stampy. But it's like Party Fidget. Um, I mean, it's pretty obvious that they added this skin just so they could give uh, Stampy uh, a pretty cool party hat, but that's that's okay, whatever. Um, but the next one we got uh, from Party Dust and Elysian Tail, which is pretty cool. I don't really know who this is because I never played that game, but it's okay, I guess. Um, and then you got Jack of Blades, Fable. This, I think the next couple ones, they started redoing some of the old skins, so I think they redid this skin. Um, but I don't know if it looks better or not, so yeah. Uh, and then this isn't, uh, this is actually a new one. They didn't redo this one, but this is a completely new one. I actually like this one, <laughs> especially if you like being a chicken. This is the skin for you. Um, okay, and the next one, these, uh, I think the next, like, yeah, the next, like, six or so are redos of old skins as well. Uh, this is Horstachio from Viva Pinata, which that game was never good, <laughs> but the skins look pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, this is like a I think it's like a hippopotamus or a horse. I think it's a horse because it's called horse stachio. Yeah. So this is a pretty cool skin. That's not bad. I like it. Um, and then the next skin we got here is pretzel tail. Um, I actually don't know what this is. Maybe it's a squirrel, but I really do like the tail on this one and the ears. It's pretty cool. If you like this kind of stuff, uh, definitely pick that skin. Uh, and then you got the fudge hog. Um, I don't know why they all have like food in their names, but <laughs> this is this is Fudge Hog, also from Viva Pinata. It's got a weird back thing. I think it's like a head. Oh, it's a hedgehog. It's like a hedgehog. Yeah, that's it. So this is a. If you want to be a hedgehog, that's called Fudge Hog. Then <laughs> I would go for that skin. Uh, and this, these are a couple of pretty cool skins. Actually, my my good friend is this skin. Uh, it's Conquer from Conquer's Bad Fur Day. Uh, it's really cool. The tail is pretty awesome too. Um, yeah, so they they really started adding those really big detailed uh, skins to the second birthday skin pack, which is pretty sweet. You also got this Conquer from Conquer Live and Reloaded, basically like an army version of the other squirrel one right here. Uh, both have their big fluffy tails. Uh, this one seems a little bit more like uh, orangish, or I don't know. They're they're different different color skins. Like if you look at that tail, it looks like a yellowish 
and this looks more orangish, I guess, I don't know. But th those are pretty cool. These are all remakes, I'm pretty sure, uh, these five. And actually, I think this is also a remake, B Banjo and Kazooie. Uh, this, uh, is actually Alfred Lee skin, if you guys didn't know that. And, yeah, they added, uh, Kazooie to the back of Banjo, so that's, it's kind of cool. It's not bad. But I think the other one does look a little cooler. This does look a little, little more accurate, probably, but I think the other one's a little bit better. Uh, and then you also just have Kazooie if you want to be Kazooie at any point, which is pretty cool. It looks like a bird, so I think it's cool. Um, and then the next one you got here is Gruntilda from Banjo-Kazooie. This is not a remake. Um, these two are not remakes. This one was, but this, these two aren't. Um, I guess those are from Banjo-Kazooie as well. And then the next one you got here is the Party Grunt from Halo, which is pretty cool. Uh, the reason why they added some Halo skins, I'm pretty sure, is because uh, they were about to add Halo, uh, the Halo skin pack, which is right here. Um, oh, crap. <laughs> but yeah, um, they were about to add Halo, so they just added some birthday party Halo skins, which is pretty cool. And they added the red and uh, blue Spartans with uh, the party hats, and those are pretty cool. I, I think they should have gave this one this, like, it's a different party hat than these one, than, like, this one. I think this one should have gotten the same kind of party hat, but that's okay. Or maybe they should have added Master Chief as well, but that's okay. The whole This whole skin pack was a really sweet skin pack. You guys should definitely consider downloading it. It is another free skin pack um, that they added to 360 and the Xbox One. And uh, another reason uh, they added, like, I'm so excited that they added, they added all of these to, like, Xbox One. So I can finally be my birthday cake man on Xbox One. I'm pretty excited about that, but... Alright, so we got the third and final skin pack that they added for this birthday, which is right here. Alright, so this is a really, this is a really interesting skin pack. It's actually, uh, it's really weird, because most of these skins are actually, um, people that work at 4J, or Mojang in general. Um, so yeah, uh, the first one we have here is Jen. So we can actually start becoming some of these ones. So this one, this one is Jen, um... It's pretty kind of cool. I don't know if this is supposed to be Jeb. Um, maybe Jeb is a Gen. I don't know what a Gen really means. I, I'm a little confused what it means, but it looks kind of cool. If you really like being a redheaded character and you want glasses, I guess, and you got a little ponytail, I think this is definitely Jeb because I think Jeb looks like this. I don't know. If you guys know who exactly it is, go ahead and comment down below. I'm not that smart and who everyone is from 4, uh, 4J or Mojang, but yeah. All right, so that's a pretty cool skin. It's not bad. Um, and then, let's see, the next one we got here is the Daniel Kaplan. I know this guy is from, uh, 4J. He's a pretty cool guy. I think he's from 4J, or he's Mojang. I'm not, I'm <laughs> not entirely sure. But this guy's kind of cool. It's got a little bit plain. He's got a cool white t-shirt. It's not bad. I like him. I like him a lot. All right. So, next one. <laughs> next one, yeah, it's a little boring. Uh, but the next one we got here is Marcus, uh, or aka Junk Boy. Um, uh, I don't know who this one entirely is. I feel like this is Mojang. I feel like some of these first ones are Mojang, but that's okay. Um, so yeah, that's a pretty cool one, I guess. It looks like a wrestler. Actually, I'm not gonna lie, this is actually the coolest, uh... Ooh, let's get back up here. This is actually the coolest, uh, wrestler skin I think I've we've seen on Minecraft. So, if you want to be a wrestler, yeah, I'd definitely go for this skin. It's actually pretty cool. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Alright, so we'll go to the next one. Uh, let's see what we got here. We got, uh, Aaron. Uh, I don't know who exactly this is. It looks like... I think it's a bike helmet on his head. I can't really... The back looks like a bike helmet. I don't know what entirely it is, but it looks pretty cool. It's, it's a little plain. I think most of these are going to be kind of plain. There's a couple of... Oh. <laughs> Whoops. I... Uh, okay, there we go. There's a couple of plainish ones, um, but I think it's kind of cool that they added themselves to the game. Um, but yeah. Alright, so the next one we got here is um, this one, Mattis. This one's pretty interesting um there's like a bomb on this guy's shirt it's pretty cool it's not bad i think there's some like golden glasses that he's wearing too um it's pretty sweet let's see what his back looks like yeah. Yeah, most of these are pretty plain we got a plain t-shirt plain pants uh i think it's just like little details that add to them that make it them so it's pretty cool all right so we'll go on to the next one um let's see we got here henrik this is actually i'm not gonna lie i mean this guy is a little plain but he's kind of cool looking he looks he looks kind of old he looks like he kind of looks like he'd be a, a grandfather. I don't know if he's actually old. I don't actually know who this guy is. Actually, I don't know. Look at... I don't know. Henrik. That's that's this guy's name. I don't know if the, Henrik is actually old, but he looks kind of like a cool old man that you could uh, have as a character or something. I don't know. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's not It's not the best skin ever, but it's pretty cool. 
All right. So we also got Daniel Frisk. Um, let's see, looks interesting. He's got like a moon on his shirt, I think, or maybe it's like a symbol for something. I don't know entirely for sure. Um, but yeah, it's a little plain. <laughs> All right, we'll go on to the next one. I mean, these aren't as good as the first two, in my opinion, just because the first two had just like really cool skins, like from Minecraft, but. These are just like Mojang people. I, I mean, 4J and Mojang might appreciate these skins. I don't know if we really appreciate them. Like, there's a couple of them I like, but yeah. All right, so the that was Daniel Frisk. The next one we got here is John. I, you know, honestly, I don't even feel like I should be some of these people because these next three people are very similar. <laughs> you got John. Here, I'll just I'll just tell you about them. This one's John. Um, pretty pretty plain, boring. I mean, I guess it's pretty cool for the like the actual real life character or like real life person. It'd be cool for them to be in the game, but honestly, for us, it's like, eh, okay. Um, next person, this guy is kind of cool because he's got, like, a ponytail. Um, it's Mans with a weird star above his A. Uh, I don't know what's on the front of the shirt. I can't tell what that is at all. Um, it just looks like random pixels, but I'm guessing it's something. Uh, but it's pretty cool. It's not bad. I mean, they're all pretty plain and boring. They all have the same color. Look, at these four people have the same color pants. Like, you can uh, change pants. I don't know. This is just kind of dumb. I'm guessing they're like jeans, but... All right, the next guy you got here is Johan. Um, pretty plain. Pretty boring. Got like a leather jacket, white t-shirt, blue pants, shoes, normal face. I don't know. Pretty plain and boring. Okay, so this one is a girl. Um, we finally got some girl characters. Uh, this is Lydia. You got pink hair. Um, if you like pink hair and you're a girl like that likes pink hair, I guess that's a pretty cool skin for you to be. But that's Lydia. I'm guessing from I'm guessing most of these are from 4J, but I've guess a couple's from Mojang. But I think this one's from 4J. Um, so yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, next one we got Karen. I uh, don't know really know who these people are, but you got Karen here. Um, pretty nice girl skin, I guess. It's not bad. I mean, if I was a girl and it had some of these free skin options, I'd probably I don't know, maybe pick one of them? I don't know. Uh, and then the next one you got here is Chris... Christopher? Christopher? I don't know. <laughs> I don't really know who this is either, but it's still kind of plain and boring. Just like most most of these. But the next couple are not plain and boring. Next ones are my couple favorite ones. You got Nathan here, which is actually really close to my name. My name's actually Nathaniel, but... It's pretty close to my name, but he's upside down, so we're gonna actually be this guy. Um, he's pretty cool. He walks upside down. He's got a creeper shirt on is pretty awesome. I think this is Dinnerbone. I don't know if Dinnerbone's name is Nathan. I think it's Dinnerbone. I'm not entirely sure if you, if you guys know if it is or not. Go ahead and comment that down below. But uh, yeah, I think this is uh, oh, <laughs> I think this is Nathan, but it's pretty cool. Pretty cool like upside down skin. That's the the reason why when you name something Dinnerbone it turns upside down. Um <laughs> let's see if we can actually let's get a villager. Let's get an anvil. Let's get a name tag. Let's see if we can name uh, let's see. I don't actually. I can't actually see. I didn't. I didn't even grab the anvil. Well, that was dumb of me. All right, there we go. Put that in. Let's see. Dinner bone. Did I spell that right? I believe I did. And we'll get our villager, which is right there. And then get the name tag like that. Oh, I gotta do that. There we go. It's dinner bone. He's upside down. You can't actually see his name because I have a. Uh, the name tags, I believe, off. Um, but yeah, I think I think we're pretty much the same now, man. We're like brothers. We're brothers because we're upside down together. <laughs> That's pretty funny. All right, but uh, anyways, yeah, it's a pretty cool skin. Uh, the next skin is also upside down, uh, which I believe I still don't know who this is. This could actually, you know what? I think this is Dinner Bone. I think. I think this is more Dinner Bone. I think this is somebody else. I don't know for sure. But they're both upside down, so they one of them probably is dinner bone, and I'm probably just dumb and don't know who everybody is. Uh, but yeah, this is this is uh, Eric. I think I think this one's dinner bone. I don't, I'm not entirely sure because I th I know I saw a dinner bone tweet out a picture of himself with his skin upside down. I think this one looks like that picture, so I think this is him. I think this is dinner bone. I'm pretty sure. But uh, yeah, anyways, <laughs> it's a pretty cool skin upside down. We're all upside down here. Uh, but yeah. <laughs> But, okay, let's see, let's change skins again. Uh, I think we have uh, three more, and these ones are not uh, Mojang people or 4J people. They added these next three as, like, characters from, like, what Minecraft would be. This guy is the Redstone Man. 
a uh, pretty pretty interesting one. He looks like a redstone block. Let's let's jump over here. Um, yeah, it's not not bad. Let's see. Let's get out the redstone block. Um, of course, I'm in a different texture pack, so it doesn't actually look like me. But yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. I like it. It's not bad. Uh, I just don't particularly love redstone. All right, and then the next. Actually, I do like redstone, but I don't want to be redstone. You know what I mean? All right. Uh, the next one we got here is the end man, which is actually this one's. The first, my favorite one is the the Nathan one, just because it's part of my name, kind of. It's got a cool creeper shirt, and it's upside down, so it's, I think that one's my favorite one. Um, and then my second favorite one is this guy. Uh, this guy's kind of creepy looking, <laughs> because like he's looking at you with your eye, with his eye of Ender, but uh, I actually like it. I don't know, it looks cool. I think I think this is a good addition for a skin. Uh, somebody should definitely try to be the skin. I think it's really cool. Um, but yeah, that's pretty awesome. All right, and then you got the last skin here which is the sandstone man, which is pretty cool. It reminds me of the, uh, the stone man because, you know, sandstone, stone. Uh, I think I know why they added this one because they recently, I mean, it's not that recent, but I think it was since their past or second birthday that they've added the extra sandstones, like the chiseled and smooth, but yeah. So yeah, that's, that's all the skins there. I hope you guys enjoyed the video here. Uh, if you do, if you did, leave a like. Um, and also comment down below if you want to say something. And subscribe if you haven't as well. Um, and yeah. Oh, and uh, I should say something about this. Um, yeah, this is uh, this was actually a hide and seek I was working on. It's uh, as you can tell, it's the 4J Studios Lounge. It's pretty cool. I changed stuff around. It's much smaller, so you could actually play as in hide and seek. Although it's still a pretty huge hide and seek map. Uh, I think I might try to release this. I don't know for sure. Uh, I still have to finish like the fridge here. I didn't put anything in it, but once that's done, I think this this map's like ready to ready to play as hide and seek. But uh, I didn't. I tried making a second map. It's actually pretty cool. It's called 4J Bar. Um, actually, it's not called 4J Bar. I just put their bar over here. I'm trying to make um, a little bit of like a 4J office instead of just their lounge. Um, if you come out here, I put some signs like 4J Studios Office, 4J Studios Lounge right there. I'm trying to make these hide and seeks um, so I can release them, um, but I have not finished the Forge Studios office and it's still got quite a ways to go and I don't really have that much time to finish it, so I don't know if I'm going to release it or not. If you guys really want me to release it, um, go ahead and comment down below. Um, release it even if I don't finish that one. I will try to finish this one because all I have to do is the fridge and then it's complete. Like I don't have to do anything else to it, but if you guys want me to release it without this one being done. Um, go ahead and comment down below or tweet at me or do whatever you can to try to make me release this one uh, but I, th I might do it anyways <laughs> but just because this actually took a while because I was trying to remake everything even though you know I've added some new stuff to this map um, especially some uh, modded stuff I added like colored glass which is like right over there but yeah if you guys want me to release it comment down below and yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, as I said before, like it, comment, blah, blah, subscribe, you know what I mean? Oh. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'll see you cake lovers. Oh, I'm not a cake though. I'm not a cake. Where's my cake? Where's my cake? I gotta be a cake. I gotta, I gotta sign out as a cake. There we go. All right, I'll see you cake lovers <laughs> in the next video. Bye.